This video is about replacing the exhaust risers on our twin Detroit Diesel Series 60's wet exhaust engines. We start by taking photographs of the old system and sending it out to get bids on replacing it. Then we begin the process of removing the old and installing the new systems. We have selected vendors to help us, Metcalf Marine in Florida and Western Branch Diesel in Beaufort, North Carolina. So, what do you need? What size? 9 sixteenths. Ratchet or? Uh, no, it was wrench. We need a 9 sixteenths up there. We'll just take these two bottom. That's right here. They're loose here. That's okay. Th do you think we need to take it from up there? Um, All right. Now you got it. Yeah, see, it's heavier you think it is. Yeah, now what do we do? I don't know. Pivot. <laughs> yeah. Pivot this. Watch it. Go. We don't want to bend that. Uh, there you go. Okay. Okay, now we got to get that, that to come off. Oh. I had those loose. Uh, you see your. Whoa, yeah, whoa, whoa, you're, whoa, whoa, whoa. you're behind the you water that, filter there. The water filter, you're going to snap that off, Bradley. Okay. Can't go up high enough. Okay. That's the problem. No, we're gonna have to take that hose off. Yep. If we get some uh, simple green and a screwdriver and just work around that, and we get that off, and we'll go ahead and take this off too, buddy. Okay. Okay. You all right, buddy? Yep. Just ease it on out. If two people can lift it, I'll again get down there and. You guys know what you're doing. I'll go down here. Oh, uh, we don't know what we're doing. We're just doing. <laughs> Actually, just come straight through here. Just watch those things where his hands are. Yep, I got it on this side. I got it this way. No, we don't get it on the chrome. No. Chrome's got to get you home. You want to get your chin? Huh? Take it down. Still in the lip of the turbo, we need to get the screwdriver and just give it a little pry. Uh, it's, it's stuck in there pretty hard. Yeah. Okay. What? Oh, yeah. There's a little piece down there, too. Alright. We're gonna jiggle it. You ready to go up? Yeah, let's go up. Yay! Well, you got it? Yep. There we go. See, no, no, no crap went on any stuff. No, no. You didn't get nothing. You got it, buddy? Yeah, you got it. Okay. So now I gotta just take everything apart and figure out how to... This one's gonna be easy. I'm not worried about this one. A little worried about how we get that one in the engine room. Well, to be good idea. Just to make it easier. Do you want a hand getting it in the bunk berth? No, there's people there. Thank you. Okay. You can just slide it right. Yeah. You want me to just whatever end you want to go with. Here, I'll just lift it up. I'll guide. Okay, just set it right here for a minute. All right. Okay. I got it. You got it? Good. Blanket. Um, this one. Okay. All right. All right. Let's watch these things. Bob. Yeah. Let's roll it right on up. So now we need to pick it up and get these 
close to this position. Just mock it up first and see how it looks. And we got to spin it while we pick it. Yeah. Okay. I got this side. If you control that side. Turbo, if you can hold that side, ah. somewhat line it up to a. I got it. Okay. All right. All right, we're safe. There, we're going to drop this side. We're going to come in like that into the bellows, and then attach that, and then slide this in. Okay. All right. We might need another set of hands to do Richard. all this. Come on in. Right here. Right here. Okay. Try to guide that from not hitting too much. You see that piece is going to snap in and out. Mm -hmm. It's got a it's little got a lip. lip. Yeah. We don't want to chip the lip. Okay. So you want to just take the weight off of it. Yes. Pull it straight back. Straight back and drop it down. Yeah. Okay. All right. Inside that hose there a little bit too. Down there too? Yeah, that's fine. Slippery. Oh. Oh. Okay. All right. Don't lift on your side yet. Yeah. Okay. Come down. You got to get. Oh, this is gonna be fun. All right, we're in out towards Bradley if you can. Out, going. All right, all right, in, 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 in. You're in. All right. There's a definite angle here that's not right yet. Yeah. Right, this is it. There we go. This end is in right here. On this thing, yeah. real hard. There we go. All right, this end is in. Okay. okay. Now, how far off are we on that side? Uh, you're inch and a half. So it's on the screw heads. Yeah, and it's off probably by an inch and a half or two inches between this tube and that tube. It's yes, not. there's a. Oh, they didn't. All the loads on that side, which it's higher up now, too. Here are the pictures. Main thing I'd like to see is how the uh, suspension was held. Can you see how much? Uh, not a lot. There was yeah. it was just a little, and it was and it was balanced. I mean, I remember it being balanced when we did it. Okay. All right. Okay. So look at this. This is really interesting how they make this. Mm -hmm. I mean, they literally made that, didn't they? Yep. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, it's designed to actually have a little bit of pressure in here. It's got to have four and a half to five and a half psi uh -huh. to make that spray to actually cool the gotcha. inside of it, so it doesn't burn your yeah bellows hose there. Not on that? Yeah, when you're taking the holder. Got that plastic in the way. There you go. I'm, I'm holding it up so you can get it in there with no problem. Let's get it on. All right. Okay. Wow, well, we're, we're quite a bit away from there. Okay. And does that line up pretty good? Yeah. Trick. Oh, yeah, it works I never saw that before. I like that. 
Much easier than the finger. Mm. <laughs> and it goes all the way around the three edges. Nothing to worry about. Yep. That's how you prevented them from starting when you were yes. circulating yes. oil. Full main power and tuner. So next step is to start them. Yep. Up here, and I'll look at these up here. Yes, sir. <laughs> Maximum speed of the boat. Yeah. 